I think uh, I think one of the biggest things that that we always make sure that we have on site is really good communication, and that might come in the form of of a really good radio plan uh, where we've got you know police and medical uh, and our staff volunteers all you know being properly communicated with. You might have a um, maybe that's a a bunch of cell towers and everyone's got you know. Cell phones, they're communicating that way. That might be um, a really good uh, set of radios and a repeater that might be uh, you know, at the top of the hill. Um, so I think that for us, you know, having a really good communications plan is something that you can't do without at a big event. I don't think uh, you ever wind down at the event. A lot of our events are just one day, but we have multiple events that are five or even six days in a row. Uh, and uh, it's a lot of getting up at you know four thirty five o'clock in the morning and working until ten o'clock at night. Hopefully, get some dinner after ten o'clock and uh, get your four to five hours of sleep and you're back on it. Uh, so, I don't think we really wind down until after it's all over. Uh, but um, you're kind of on the whole time. I like to wind down after an event by going to a nice restaurant, maybe having a couple of beers and just kind of relaxing and kind of talking about the event, and maybe what went well and what didn't go well, make some notes, uh, but just to kind of relax with uh, the key staff here at USA Cycling and, um, and uh, have some good food.